Hello, hello, handbag lovers. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to a new video. If you're new here, my name is Kayla, and today I want to share with you my luxury black handbag collection. So let's get started. Okay, so I'm going to start with this baby right here. This is the YSL Kate in the size medium, of course, with gold hardware. I got this handbag at the end of 2021, so it's going to be almost two years since I have this handbag. I am so impressed about um, the quality of this handbag in, in YSL and I am so impressed about the wear and tear. It looks almost like new. The chain is really nice. The hardware honestly has uh, some scratches but it's mostly for the chain but it's not like that noticeable. I mean uh, from far away I don't see anything just if I look really really close so that doesn't bother me at all i made a video i mean all the review about this handbag i will link the video up here and yeah she's really elegant and really really classy i don't wear this handbag that much and because of that because it's like more elegant so i wear this handbag for special occasions i wish sometimes i got this handbag in the small size because sometimes uh for special occasions and things like that uh, I want to bring a small handbag uh, with me so this one is a little bit big for a special occasion sometimes and it's uh, you know just one compartment in here and we have another compartment here for me for every day I can wear this handbag because if it's my essentials really really nice I mean I, I can put everything here my phone and everything that I need to bring with me now so I've used this handbag also like casual with, with sneakers and things like that I think with the silver hardware this handbag will be more casual I think the gold made this handbag more dressy I was considering selling this one like a few months ago and my husband was like no don't sell that one because my husband really really loves this handbag and other that I, I'm going to show you in a minute I mean he like doesn't for me for him all the Levitons are the same but some handbags like this one he really really likes one thing that I don't like about this handbag is that uh, this leather sometimes shows like fingerprints I don't know I don't know if you're going to be able to tell in camera, but sometimes uh, with my makeup and things like that, this leather uh, tends to, you know, show all fingerprints and everything. But I always bring with me with this handbag like a wipe because sometimes that bothers me, like the fingerprints and things like that. But yeah, this baby is really beautiful. I used to own this handbag in the beige color, but I sold that handbag yeah, I used to own this handbag in the beige color. <laughs> I just did the video handbags I sold and why and I forgot about the beige. And yeah, it was really beautiful, the beige color, but because, you know, like I said, I don't use this one that much, I sold uh, the beige one. Sometimes I regret selling the beige one, but if I am going to get another, you know, Kate, I think I will get the white. But I think right now I'm okay with this one. This one is beautiful. Next, I have this beautiful vintage Chanel. This is actually a clutch, but it fits a lot. And I think this one fits a little bit more than the YSL. And I really like this one. I bought this one in the beginning of 2021. I bought this one in Fashion File. It was a nice price, honestly. It was like 2000 and something. Like it was less than two, like 2500 and yeah she's really really beautiful i really love that the chanel vintage comes with the um you know gold faded so the condition in this bag is really really nice i really like it doesn't have that much crushes i think i want to take this handbag to a spa or something i would love uh to get the handbag like painted i would love it like a little bit more um black i don't know why and like i said uh this one fits um a lot of styles it's my necessities honestly we have one compartment in here and we have another uh, zipper compartment in here i'm going to show you and i really like that this zipping zipper compartment comes with um you know like a chanel thingy there so this zipper compartment is really nice i keep the authenticity card in there this one i don't know about the series or anything like that 
but I look online and this one is from, from 1994, something like that. So it's almost 30 years old, wow. And I always have my bags, you know, with things inside to keep the structure. One thing that I like about this handbag is that it's vintage and it doesn't have like uh, any weird smell or anything like that. So I, the chain is a little bit long, but I always, you know, cross the chain here to where the handbag like, on the um, you know on the crook of my arm or short shoulder uh, this is a perfect length for me like that to wear like short shoulder or on the crook of my arm the length is not that long to uh, use this handbag crossbody but uh, this one I don't use that much I don't know why um, I have two three Chanel authentic and I don't know why I don't use my Chanel bags that much. I don't know. I don't know if, if it's because they're expensive. I don't know. I don't know what is the reason I have two, I think two Chanel that are not authentic and I use those more than uh, this Chanel. So, but yeah, she's really beautiful. I don't think this one I will sell like ever because I really like it. And my husband really likes this handbag too. And for, like at some point consider selling this one but my husband was like okay if you're going to sell that one it's because you're going to buy another chanel if not don't sell it so that's why i didn't sell it and yeah i think i will keep this one because she's really classy and she's a lady okay, next another black and gold hardware so this is my favorite combination honestly so what can i say about this handbag i really really love it i am so happy that i got this handbag that i have this handbag in my collection uh because uh she's amazing i really love this leather it's so so beautiful the only thing that i'm worried sometimes is that this handbag like the you know this style the new style doesn't come with this uh thing right here but this old style uh i've seen some of them that the wear and tear is really i don't know i don't like it like this handbag will show wear and tear uh it doesn't look that puffy over the time so i don't know uh, because i don't use this handbag like every day i think uh the wear and tear right now is really really nice i bought this handbag on river and it came with some scratches but honestly it doesn't show that much and i don't mind about that and i think i don't baby my handbags that much but this part doesn't have any scratches the scratches are in this part but like i said it's not that noticeable so we have two compartments on this handbag we have one compartment in here one in the middle and another one here so it's three compartments this handbag um doesn't fit uh that much or you will think it will fit a lot but fits my essentials really really nice and actually a little bit more but it looks like a big handbag you know i told you in my video that handbags i sold and why that i sold the pochette matisse because it was kind of like the same vibe and yeah the pochette matisse will fit more than this one honestly because i think because the way the handbag is is made because it's like kind of like three pochettes in one so it doesn't fit like like you think it's going to fit but i like to wear this handbag mostly and dressy with this gold chain with the strap that it comes with the handbag that is a black strap i don't like that strap honestly i like to wear this handbag with this strap that it comes in my, in my speedy 20 i really like how it looks and this one is like like well made i don't know the strap that it comes in this one things looks a little bit cheap i don't know but like i said i wear this one mostly um dressy with this chain this chain is beautiful and also i like to wear this chain with other louis vuitton bags so yes i i love 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 this bag. i have the chanel double classic flap in the size medium with silver hardware so yeah i own this handbag since 2021 and i remember when i got this handbag i wanted to use this handbag like all the time i was going to target and i will bring this handbag with me but lately i haven't reached for this handbag that much i don't know why last year it was in my least used uh, handbags of the year too and this year i think it will be two because i don't reach for her that much even though of course she's a classy and with the silver hardware i think it's really 
more casual. I like to take this handbag uh, to travel with me because I can wear this handbag more dressy, you know, in the evening or at night, and I can wear this handbag also casual. And yeah, for me, the medium size is really practical. I really love that it comes with the leather in the inside because it's really nice to clean. I mean, these handbags, they are expensive, but they will last you forever. I mean, I would recommend to buy this, uh, you know, handbag preload because new, it's crazy. And I really like this compartment. I put my phone in here and I always have really access to my phone in that part. This one, I like to use it this way, like on the crook of my arm. And I just, um, and I just put the chain in this part like this and that way I can use it you know like that uh, on the crook of my arm and of course you know it's really comfortable to wear this handbag uh, on the shoulder and uh, this one it looks really I can wear this handbag sometimes crossbody but it looks really like a little bit awkward because uh, of the length of the chain but yeah this is a handbag that I think I will never get rid of her because right now I am not reaching for her but I think at some point I will. Sometimes I do that, sometimes I just forget about a handbag and then I start using the handbag more and more. So yes. Next I have my Louis Vuitton Felici pochette in this beautiful Emprion leather. I really love this handbag because the gold hardware it's really like subtle and also the logos are, are really subtle so it's not that in your face you know Louis Vuitton or, or luxury and I don't wear um, like silver jewelry that much but my dressy shoes they come with like stones and things that are silver and I can wear this one with those shoes because the hardware is not that much I love this one I haven't used this one that much honestly so I I love to use this one, you know, for like, of course, special locations. She fits like your essentials when you go on a day night, you know, your lipstick, um, your phone, your car holder, and, and maybe your car keys. But yeah, she's really nice. I really like to wear this handbag like this you know like short shoulder it's really comfortable and i think the felicity pochette i really like to see this handbag in other people like all of the felicity pochette like the classic monogram the, the mia azur all of them when i see this handbag in other people i'm like oh my god it looks really really cute i think it looks really classy and really elegant i don't know because of the size because it's uh, just like a simple bag, but a really, really beautiful bag. I mean, I would recommend this handbag a lot because the price is not that crazy. And also it comes with two pouches, a car holder kind of, and also another pouch we can use to have necessities and other handbags. That's how I use the pouches that it comes in this kind of, um, you know, wallet on chains. But yeah, I love this one because it's a wallet on chain that I can wear at night and also I like to wear this one sometimes during the day uh, with just my necessities in this one and yeah the, the strap is detachable so I can put another casual strap on this one so this one I would recommend a lot honestly it's a really classy hammer. Okay, next I have this Gucci one this is the mini horse bit and oh my god how much I love 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 to wear this handbag this is not authentic but I don't mind I love it. I really, really like it. Honestly, I am considering on getting this one in the beige color because it's really beautiful. I already decided that my next handbag is going to be a Gucci one. I think I'm going to buy it at the end of September or the beginning of October. I'm going to Europe, so I think I will get it there. I'm not sure yet. But yes, I'm considering this one in the beige color. It's because I love this style a, a lot. I love that it comes with this strap that is really, really nice. It's really comfortable to wear with this strap. Also, I can wear this strap, uh, you know, like 
just here like on the shoulder and it doesn't fall even though it's a big strap and i like that because it's really comfortable to wear and also it comes with this uh black strap that is adjustable and i can wear this one more dressy i like to wear this one to the office i like to wear this one you know with shorts with dresses oh my god I really really love it and it's really like you know quiet luxury only if you know you know and the interior is just one big compartment and sometimes the bags come with compartment and I don't use them but in this one the other day I was like where's my compartment I was like uh, I wanted another compartment but yeah it's just one big compartment and this is another one that caches all fingerprints that's one thing that I don't like but again, I always bring with me with this kind of bag, like a uh, wipe. Sometimes with the um, cloth that is for cleaning my sunglasses, I clean them because I don't, I don't like, you know, fingerprints on the bag. It drives me crazy sometimes. But yes, I love, love, love this handbag. It's one of my favorites. Okay, and last but not least, the newest handbag in my collection is this baby right here. This is the Pochette Matisse East West uh, in the Emprion leather by color. This is the color Noir Beige. And of course, it's this beautiful bag with the, you know, logo uh, in the beige color. It's really really nice honestly this is not authentic this one was sent to me from say bullet I've shown you before bags that they have sent me to show you guys and wow I am really impressed like every time I see the bags from them I'm like oh my god it's so crazy because they are so so similar so I uh, you know picked this one because I love 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 my pochette Matisse uh, you know it's West in the classic monogram the authentic that I wanted to try you know another color uh, yes uh, I'm not sure about this color honestly I think it's too much i think it's so much logo even though of course the classic monogram it's a logo but i know i think this one is like more and of course it comes with the strap this gold strap i saw the strap that it came in my you know authentic pochette matisse west because i i don't like this strap like one of you told me that i can use this one as a necklace and that's a nice idea i sold uh the one it came in my authentic because i don't like it i don't use it and because i wish this one was a little bit more long to use the bag uh, on the shoulder but it's really really nice i'm going to show you in a minute like kind of like you know real versus fake so i have this strap this one i really really like uh, like this and one thing i i like about this one is that this one it doesn't go like a little bit but my authentic one goes a little bit more you know like that and this one it stays this one it doesn't do that <laughs> wow can you imagine <laughs> so yeah i love uh the pochette Matisse west style and i'm going to show you really close this one because i want you to see like the details in the buckle look the leathers i mean they look really really on point really nice and the leather like i mean it feels so so nice and this is the back this is the bottom of uh the bag yeah looks really really nice oh and the back zipper is really really nice and we have you know this bag four compartments one here one in the zipper another one in here and in the back and the microfiber lining feels so nice wow um wow i'm really really impressed honestly and uh this is the strap i really like this one um i love this bag crossbody i really really enjoy wearing mine crossbody and i'm going to show you like how crazy similar um the gold uh hardware is to the authentic okay uh i have them here this is the replica one and this is the authentic one look at that like only putting them side by side you will notice like the different and it's a little bit of difference and look at the letters wow <laughs> they are really really similar 
this is crazy honestly and we have like the top handle and yeah i really love to wear my pochette matisse is west the authentic one that's why i wanted to try you know another color um, like i said i'm not sure about this color i think it's a little bit too much i will wear this handbag this weekend tomorrow i'm going on a road trip i mean i'm going to savannah georgia because we are moving there soon so i will uh wear this handbag this weekend and see how i feel about it not because it's a replica it's because i'm not sure entirely about the colorway uh, honestly i will feel a hundred percent confident on wearing this handbag um because i don't care actually i don't care because i don't have to prove anything to anyone if i like a handbag i will wear it even though it's not authentic because I'm blessed, thank God, and I can afford an authentic. I mean, not a lot of handbags, you know, I have to think about it because I'm not rich, okay? But I can afford the authentic, and of course, when I buy, you know, an authentic bag, I mean, for me, it's, I mean, I love it, you know? But I don't care if I like a replica bag, I mean, I will wear it, but I'm not sure entirely, like I said, about the colorway. But uh, it's a really nice handbag. I regret not to order the other color, the one that is um, like gray. Uh, I mean, because I don't have anything like that in my collection. But yeah, I wanted to show you this handbag. So yeah, this is the video for today. I hope you like it. Please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Also subscribe to my channel if you like this kind of content and see you until the next video. Bye. Mm.